three ghosts trapped on video. Hello folks all over the world, welcome back to the 19th episode of the Top 3 Ghosts series which, as usual, awaits you every Saturday with three new videos appropriately selected from the tide of videos that run on the internet. Bad weather hits much of the planet this week, but that doesn't stop our paranormal investigators. If you are a veteran you already know that the contents will leave you with some questions, but if you are new and you like these videos do not forget to press the button subscribe to the channel to help improve the series. We start the dances, as usual from our third position. The Ghost Who Watched the Family The video in question was reported to us via email by the user, Simon Poba 75 who writes about a video on YouTube asking us for an analysis on it. The video was posted on the Best Tips YouTube channel on November 13, 2019, a channel with only two Danish language videos, presumably we should be near between Copenhagen and the city of Horsholm, Denmark. The owner of the channel, named Daniel, explains that this video was shot by his grandfather about 40 years ago with an 8mm camera, where he documents a trip with his family to a deserted forest. In the video we see a woman crossing the forest with her two children, but in the background in the distance we see a female figure who, according to Daniel's father, was not there at the time of the film because the forest was deserted. Now let's listen to Daniel's father's testimony regarding the video. Det er et klip fra en film, som min far har optaget, da vi var for 40 år siden, da vi var ude på tur i skoven. Og det som vi sidder og ser, så pludselig så, så står der en, en skikkelse en, en, lidt inde i skoven. Og den person var der ikke, da vi gik tur. Så spørgsmålet er, hvordan er den dukket op? Er det et spøgelse? The figure in the distance appears to be female, wearing a light shirt and a long dark colored ancient skirt, furthermore the face appears very dark of a strange brown color but not so much as to attribute it to a black person. There are no facial features and the woman seems practically motionless to observe the scene. In the analysis of the color spectrum the figure seems perfectly inserted in the context of lights and shadows, in scale with the surrounding environment, it does not have graphic corrections or additions that suggest it is a fake, so we are in front of a genuine film. Truly a scary document, we cannot say whether it is a real person or a ghost, surely a lonely woman of apparent middle age in the middle of the forest is a very unusual thing. And you? What opinion did you have about it? Let us know in the comments below walks from another dimension. This time we move to the state of Utah, USA. Owner JP of a YouTube channel entitled Haunted Forest Monsters on May 9, 2019 posted a really disturbing video, a clip of a long recording filmed by the security camera aimed at the car park of the mother's workplace. Let's see the whole piece. It comes comes from up there. Up there. See? It's right there. Yo, what the f I know I see it. Did you lose it? Mm-hmm. Yo. It's like over there. 
Immediately at the beginning of the footage, JP and his friend who analyzed the video, do not notice a transparent and ghostly figure, who seems to be wearing a skirt, who walks aimlessly in the middle of a totally empty parking lot and then disappears. Instead, they focus their attention on another figure that appears to come from the top end of the parking lot. The figure in question seems to be the ghostly figure of a small thin person walking slowly in the middle of nowhere, in a totally empty parking lot, at night and with abundant rain. The two follow the figure that seems to have no precise destination, in fact it disappears shortly after, always to the center of the parking lot on the other side of the building. An interesting video that seems to support the hypothesis of entities from another dimension given the uselessness of crossing such a place in the middle of the night with rain and with that slowness, but as usual we entrust the judgment totally to you, so let me know what do you think about it. Entities of the Past In position number 1 on our ranking this week we decided to analyze a bizarre video that went viral recently and has totaled 31.8 million views on the social TikTok. Posted on at Holopeter 10506 h on October 31, 2020, the video shows Peter and his little brother wandering around the great-grandparents' house, later inherited from their grandparents, a house placed in the state of Nayarit, a Mexican state located on the west coast and overlooking the Pacific Ocean. Peter in the description specifies that the grandfather passed away in 2020. Estamos aquí en la casa de mi bisabuela, se fue la... ¿Qué es eso? Se fue la luz. Eh, esta es la casi porque quiero, y mi mamá espérense que mi mamá y mi abuela se fueron al Oxxo a comprar velas por eso por lo que pasó de que se fue la luz y pues estamos aquí esas son las mi abuelito espérense no sean chillones no vamos a, no va a pasar nada y esas son las cenizas de mi bisabuelo porque pues desgraciadamente ya falleció y y el baño está allá El baño, mi hermano quiere hacer pipí, pero el baño está allá. Y mi abuela nos dijo que cuidáramos. At the end of the external corridor, in an unlit area, a really strange dark shadow moves from top to bottom, leaving the child in silence petrified with fear. Mi abuela nos, mi abuelo nos dijo que cuidáramos aquí su casa, en lo que ellas iban. Pero, espérense. Pero pues, el problema es que aquí... No sabemos. Es, y pues... No tengan miedo. No pasa nada. Abuelito, si ¿sí estás aquí, dentro de nosotros. Si estás aquí, preséntate ante nosotros. Somos tus bisnietos. ¿Nietos? On the hidden side of the wall, what appears to be a large bat in slow motion is hidden, which scares the hell out of the children, who run away. The problem is that in the sequences preceding this one we have clearly seen a corner of a bat's wing, while before we have seen a totally different dark shadow, much larger than the animal, and in total absence of light that suggests it is the projection of the animal, but there are no lights, in fact the shadow is much darker than a traditional wall projection. What is not clear in this video is whether the children were in real danger, or was it a shadow cast in an unknown way, or are we facing real paranormal activity? In Peter's TikTok channel you read a lot of comments, and Peter posts other videos showing small angles of something dark that appears to be lying on the outer roof, but the frightening big dark shadow is nowhere to be found. Thanks to everyone for watching, our appointment continues next week with new analyzes and new videos. Follow us on our social networks and stay tuned to this channel if you want to discover the paranormal with a more attentive and real eye. Good night.